The agri-food industry is the main pillar of our basic economy. The beef sector in Ontario is incredibly important. It's almost a $3 billion industry. And of course, you don't have a $3 billion industry unless you're doing great research and innovation. If we don't keep moving ahead, providing research and advancing that industry, we will fall behind. Like any facility, after a few decades, they uh, become a little bit out of date. The $15 million new facility here is part of a, a modernization of our research infrastructure. The beef facility here at Alora is going to be truly state of the art. Whether it's in measuring rumen gases or how much they eat, when they eat it, how they eat it. This really allows us to bring some state-of-the-art technology to our research. We've got in Centec feeders that allow us to precisely measure how their feed is being converted into beef to ensure that that is the most efficient that it possibly can be. Having these new facilities, we can measure uh, traits that before we could not measure and we can select more accurately those animals that are uh, genetically more efficient and more sustainable. When the old barns were built in the 70s, the, the questions that we're asking today weren't even thought about, and 40 years from now we'll be having this same discussion about what are the new questions that research needs to answer. We are extremely appreciative of the collaboration and investments made by Ontario beef producers, the provincial and federal governments, and the University of Guelph to support beef research in the province. We all have a stake in research and we all can help the industry uh, evolve to better increase our productivity so we can be more economically sustainable and then address some of the, the social uh, questions that people come to us with. Having these new facilities in Elora means uh, that we can conduct novel research, applying novel technologies and also measuring data and records and traits in the farm that is very unique nowadays. Students are our future. They really represent the next generation of agri-food innovators and this centre is a fantastic platform for exactly that. Part of my research is looking at the rumen microbiome. The microbes within the rumen play a large role in the energy produced and absorbed by the animal. So in the end, we want to integrate the animal's genome with the rumen microbiome and see if these interactions are linked to improved feed efficiency or reduced methane emissions. The kind of work that's going to go on in this uh, center really provides an opportunity for us to, in a sense, reimagine in the agricultural sector through the use of computational science, through the use of big data. If we don't work together, we will both have to do those same things and we will only move half as fast. So I think it's so great to be able to work with the university and help my agriculture community use that research to its best advantage. Imagine an industry that is informed by the best research to ensure that we've got our cattle on the best pasture and those herds are the healthiest that they possibly can be. That's what research is going to help us do.